our purifier model is Mitsubishi self Dictor Hercules series for FO purification is G160 HH procedures for starting first you have to turn off or switch off the leak detector and water detector switch located inside the multimeter panel on the right side then we have to open the suction valve from the FO setting tank Charge bulb from the clean oil going to the FO service tank. The purifier FO recirculation line. The fresh water line for the water supplying device. The butterfly bulb for the sludge discharge going to the sludge tank. Then we're gonna start the purifier motor. So as you observe, the, pre the ampere goes high to about 30, so it is normal. As it reaches its rated speed, it will go down to around 18 amperes. Upon starting, the operator is observing for vibration and abnormal sound of the motor. By switching the push button switch on the multi-monitor panel, you can switch to the uh, RPM monitor. From here, you can observe that the RPM goes up in the monitor. So, until it reaches its, its rated speed around 1700. As the motor is reaching its rated speed, you can now open the inlet bulb of the supply steam we open also the return supply steam return on the temperature controller set your temperature initial setting at 80, 80 degrees as your purifier will go to its rated speed so your temperature will go up also so as you can see on the multi monitor panel so the rpm slowly goes up observe also your ampere on the motor in the uh, motor panel so ampere is still 30 amps later it will goes down to around 18 when it reaches its rated speed now the ampere slowly going down so as you can observe the pointer slowly going down at around 19 amperes now it goes steady at uh, around 18 amperes so as you can observe on the multi-monitor panel so the rpm is 1770 so that is the rated rpm on the auto control panel you can press now the auto start button by pressing the auto start button the pure pyro goes to its uh, sequence so the filling of water and also discharging and after that the feeding process now on the multi-monitor panel you can put on the pressure mode so that you can monitor the feeding and the discharge pressure so as you can observe the pressure is still zero and the feeding is still zero so the purifier now is under its uh, feeding sequence this feeling of uh, replacement or selling water then it goes on the discharge mode you can hear a sound then after that it will uh, feed dirty oil by opening its three-way bulb so with that also you need to observe the present condition of your purifier for any vibration abnormal sound or leakages because it is now on its rated speed and operation mode you can see that is the three-way bulb operated by air so when it is uh, activated it will goes down the spring so the air is being supplied then it will start feeding dirty oil to your purifier that is on its uh, close state now that is only its activated state so if as you can observe the spring is being pressed so that is now feeding oil to your purifier so on the multi-monitor you can observe the pressure discharge pressure is rising so it means it is already feeding dirty oil to your purifier you can observe it will slowly goes up so it displays also the in the upper side the feed oil quantity kilometer 
So, temperature on the second line. Then, on the third line, it is the discharge pressure. So, initially, your temperature is very high. It will slowly goes down. A short purifier uh, will compensate its uh, normal setting. Now, we're going to make some adjustments. As you can see, the pressure now is stabilizing. Uh, feeding is 2600. Temperature is 98. So, pressure is also stabilizing. Discharge pressure. So, you need to maintain that one according to your specified uh, setting. On your temperature controller, set it to 98 degrees Celsius. That is according to the manual for HIPO purification. You need also to set your the circulation line at around 0.1 megapascal. So by slowly closing the valve, it will increase the pressure, your back pressure. Throughout the operation, you need to maintain at least 0.1 megapascal in order to have an efficient purification process of your purifier. On your auto control panel, so you need to undergo a discharge test by quickly pressing the discharge test twice. By pressing the discharge test, your purifier will undergo a discharge procedure. And now your pressure, back pressure is at around 0.1, which is normal, 0.1 megapascal. So you need to maintain that one throughout the process. Then when everything is set, you need to switch on the Click detector and the water detector. Now your purifier is running normal thanks to the operator. Special thanks to One Manhattan Crew Engine Department for making this video possible. For more videos, please like and subscribe on my YouTube channel.